loves welcome to another day in the life of michelle before we get into the vlog today if you're new here hey welcome go ahead and hit that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up because it's going to be a good one i am vlogging my day today um if you guys didn't know i am an np school and i just completed another session in my courses <laughs> And I'm going to be sharing with you guys um, the grades and everything. You guys know this is something I do in my channel and where I do a session recap. So we're going to recap my pharmacology class and I'm going to tell you guys how it went and all of that. But before I do that though, I need to do my quiet time today. So I'm about to go do that quickly and then we're going to get our day started. As of this video, I am still in Ghana. I'm also going to be meeting up with my friend a little later today. We're going to this really nice restaurant in the zoo and I'm super excited for that. But yes, guys, I'm going to be vlogging my day. I'm going to try to make this video a typical, like, a realistic day in the life here in Ghana. So, yeah, let's get the vlog started. All right, the lighting out here is amazing. The sun is so bright, but I'm about to go buy some breakfast. I'm eating cocoa today. Ooh, look at this hair, guys. I got my hair done yesterday. Um, it took eight hours, so, so long. I got not list. I can't wait to dress up later today. But I'm about to walk to buy some cocoa for breakfast, so let's go. So my cocoa lady, well, there's a lady right there. I don't know if you guys can see her. I don't usually go there. I usually go all the way up there, but I don't like her cocoa, so I'm not buying that. I'm gonna go get cocoa from this lady over here. First time for everything. I'm going to ask on. But yeah, you know, my cocoa lady is right out the door. But this is my neighborhood, y'all. Welcome to Ghana. Now that I bought my cocoa, I'm about to buy some bread. So I'm walking over there right now to buy my bread. But it's a beautiful morning. Mm. Walking back to my house. That's one thing I like about Ghana. There are things right next to you. There's some convenience in that. <sighs> Made it back home. It is hot out there. I'm about to take my shower quickly and then I'm gonna eat my breakfast and then we are going out to town. We have some errands to run. So I'm excited for that. We're buying some coconut. We're on our way to go pick up my cousin. about to buy some souvenirs. I'm about to buy some souvenirs for my friends. So let's do that. Pacha, good morning. Pacha, fun back where I 20 cities. Oh, 
stop and start. Okay. All right, we're done. Y'all can see my sweats. I am sweating. Sweating. Just made it to Kanishi. We're about to buy a couple of things before we leave. Um, it's just a huge market, one of the bigger markets. Not the biggest, I don't think, but it's pretty, pretty big. I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like. Hey guys, so I'm checking in. Time right now is almost 4 p.m. I'm now getting ready to go meet up with my friend. I wanna do a quick little haul of the things I bought today. So I told y'all we went to Kaneshin, the market. Um, I got some lotion, cause your girl was out. I buy my lotions in Ghana because they're way cheaper than they are in America. Um, I use the cocoa butter here. So I bought a bundle of that, which I am taking back with me. And I bought some fans, um, which you guys saw. Let me open this up for you guys. Ooh, child. This is what the fan looks like. Kind of just opened up like that. I bought this for my friends, so I'm super excited for them to have it. A little souvenir that I'm taking back with me. I bought like 10. So 10 of my friends are going to get lucky. And then you guys, my friend owns a company, um, Afrofuse. I'm going to link their Instagram in the box below. Please, please support them. She gifted this to me and it's literally like the most gorgeous fan I've ever seen. If you guys are interested in authentic African and fans and bags, um, let me show you. Look at this purse, y'all. Look at this purse. But please, please support them. I will put their Instagram in the description box below. Super, super cute. Um, so thank you, Afrofuse, for gifting this to me. All right, guys, so I'm not about to choose what I want to wear. I'm thinking chill, but not too chill. It's like, I want to try, but I'm not really trying. If y'all catch my drift, that's the kind of look I'm going for today. Where we're going today is pretty aesthetically pleasing, so I kind of want to take some pictures too. But y'all, I got my hair done yesterday. Um, these are not Liz braids, and they're like all the way to my butt almost. I actually wanted them like super long, like all the way down here, but they couldn't do it. Anywho, this was all under $50 plus the hair, y'all. All under $50, this is why it's essential. Please do when you get here, it's way cheaper. You know, get your hair done by the best for less. But I'm about to now pick out what I wanna to wear tonight. Like I said, I wanna do chill, but not too chill. So let's see what I end up choosing. I think I wanna do something like this. But like, like this, like dress it up. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Like I said, y'all, I didn't even bring that many clothes to Ghana, so like I don't have that many options. Let's see what this looks like on. I feel like you guys have seen me do my makeup like a billion times already, so I'm not gonna show you guys that. I'm about to just do it and then come back with my OTD for tonight. So OOTD for the night. Is this giving or not? Give this video a thumbs up if it's giving. Like it if it's giving the girls what they came for. You know, I wanted to do trying, but we're not really trying. You get the vibes, you get the vibes. Um, so outfits, okay, so these two pe this two pieces from Shein, Pretty Little Thing um, shirt. Shoes are from Pretty Little Thing as well. Jewelry, watches, Michael Kors, rings, necklace, and earrings are all from Forever 21. But yes, guys, I wanted to serve the girls tonight. I don't know. Tell me how I did in the comments. But yeah, um, I'm about to see if my dad can take me. But if not, then I'll probably Uber. outside but the guy sitting next to me was smoking and I'm not about that no I like my lungs I don't want no secondhand smoking so I requested to be moved inside and they obliged thank god so far service here is awesome I hope the food is great too so I can fully recommend them to you guys but I'm waiting for my friend to get here I'll talk to you guys when she does So, but this is what I ordered. What did you order? 
order. meters slight right checking in about NP school many many days later but this is my grade in my pharmacology class I end up getting a 91.99 which it's like bittersweet because if I had gotten a 92 I would have gotten an A minus I'm like 0.01% off it's actually very painful um, but I'm gonna show you guys my overall GPA this is the overall GPA so far in NP school and this is the final grade Urgh, just 0.1% 0.01% away from an A minus but this class you guys was so difficult probably the hardest class I've taken so far so much content learned in so little time um, and I to be honest, Chamberlain this semester did not provide a smooth learning process when it came to this. Um, so I'm hoping, I have Form 2 that I'm about to start taking very soon. So I'm hoping it's a lot different than how this class was coordinated. But besides that, it's been like the only hiccup so far in my NP program. Um, yeah, I would, still, I would still recommend them if you want like an asynchronous uh, education. So far, it's been very flexible very manageable and yeah i'm talking with my hands because because yeah but i'm just saying 
this semester was really hard, but we did it. We're at 3.8. We cannot fall below a 3.7, Michelle. Fix it. Get it together. But yeah, we'll, I'll, sh I'll let you guys know how my next semester goes. I'll sit down and talk to you guys. But yeah, that was NP school while I was on vacation in Ghana, y'all. While I was on vacation in Ghana. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye. I love y'all.